We're here at the first annual 2014 Inner Soul Celebrity Softball Draft. I'll be coaching one team. Coach Tam has got the other team. Uh, so we'll see who picks the winning team. I'm going to do the honors and give Coach Tanner the first pick. Or do you want me to take the first pick? And well, you get the why, next why do you two? want to sound like you're going to do the honors? <laughs> that you've already taken Coach Smith, you've already made up the rules, and you're going to now do the honors? Okay, well, I'll take Coach Smith. <laughs> Coach Smith, for our lovely softball team, will be my first pick. I'm glad you got her. Oh. Wow. Now I get how, do I get the first three or the first two? Just the first two. I get the first two. Okay. Uh, and our Heisman Trophy winner, George Rogers, is not playing, but I'm quite sure he would love, love to be a part of your team. He probably, he probably would, but <laughs> the goal is to win this game. So if he's not going to play, I'm going to have to go with two people that can ensure that we play great defense because you love defenders, right? I do. You love do. defenders. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Brian Busher, okay, and I'm going to take oh, the duo, <laughs> the double play combination of Wingo and Busher. Wow, you went, you went, you went. You now, went. You, you, can have, you can have this guy if you would like. He, he's a former player. He has trouble running the first. But other than that, it'll be good. You know what? I'm, I'm going to use my ace in the hole right now. Okay, on this pick, the second pick. Sure, up Leon a lot. It's my ace in the hole. Now that does concern me a little bit. <laughs> he may find something wrong with the people that I have on my team, mm -hmm. but we can't take any action until after the game. <laughs> okay. So now I'm gonna I'm gonna make a move in a different direction because I've got guys in the middle, and I need a guy that you can't hit it over his head, and if it's anywhere in the vicinity, he'll catch it. Okay. Oh. I'm going to go with Alshon <laughs> Jeffrey. He's going to bring him in. Woo! Mm, 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 mm. Mm. I think we're going to have to run the state. I'm going to go with our first gentleman of South Carolina. Woo. Mr. Michael Haley. So far, she's got me in politics. <laughs> but it looks like i got a really good team so far. <laughs> and now I've got another pick that is a former great in Major League Baseball. It could have been a Gamecock. Orlando Hudson. Mm, good pick, good pick, good pick, good pick. Uh, I'm going to have to uh, get me a big guy of my, my own, okay? I'm going to go with uh, Cliff Matthews. Good pick. Thanks for the donation too, Cliff. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of talent. And now I'm going to probably make the next pick to the person that is the Early prognostication to be the MVP of this game. Okay? No other than our own, Judy Gatson. Yeah, I thought you were a little chauvinistic because you didn't have Whoa. <laughs> women on your team. That's a, that's a great pick. That's a great pick. I'm, I'm going to have to balance it out, W-I-S, and go with uh, Rick Henry. Oh, that was a pick. I was trying to get him, but I had to take Judy first. <laughs> okay. I think that because I've always been such a, a big fan of yours and women's basketball and the WNBA, I'm going to go with Cynthia Cooper. Oh, good pick. I was trying to avoid that that look over there. Let's see. Let's see. I'm going to go with someone that um, has made Gamecock Nation very, very happy by dethroning the number one team in the country. I'm going to go with Devin. Yeah. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. Probably, probably your center fielder. <laughs> and now I'm going to go with probably a person that will hit the most home runs in this game. Big and strong. Powerful. Corey. Corey Miller. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Let's see. Uh. Let's make a point here. Okay. That I don't know if we have Mr. Irrelevant or not, but Chad Holbrook is still on the board. <laughs> you know what? Um, I'm just going to have to 
shut the, the city down and, and go with the, our mayor, Steve Benjamin. My goodness. Back into politics. <laughs> uh, apparently, I'm going to win this game. Is there a 10-run rule? Because I think I'm, I think I'm lining up pretty good here. Okay, let's see here. You know, I, I'm going to go back to the league. I'm going to go back to the league. I'm going to beat you at your own game. Shamika Holtzclaw. Okay, okay. That's a good pick. Um, well, I, I, I guess I have to go with my um, um, a competitor, but a great friend, um, Terry Flournoy from Auburn. Auburn University, hey, women's basketball coach. Wonderful. I'm sure she's working out on the planes right now, getting ready for this game. <laughs> Let's see who my next pick should be. Um, I'm going to go. I'm going to go back. I'm going to take a. I, I'm. You're making a point that Coach Holbrook is still on the board. <laughs> and I'm going to leave him on the board. You, you've gone politics, but I'm going to go popularity. Okay, one of the all-time greats. He'll help me make out the lineup, Jordan Rogers. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, I'm, I'm going to go with, um, I'm going to go with, we won go a gold medal together in the 2000 Olympics, uh, Nell Fortner. She's a winner. I'm a winner. We're on with Nell. Yeah. Except for this game. You're not going to be a winner. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go, I'm going to go back to the league, but not to the WNBA, the NFL. Ten years, a former Gamecock, Andre Goodman. Okay, well, I'm going to go with my uh, my friend over at the South Carolina campaign, Forrest. I, I was going to give you the coach, uh, Coach Tanner, you know, but since we're all winners, I'm, I'm going to go with you, Forrest. So let's go. Let's go. We need you to hit clean up. Okay. It looks like you've got me a little bit in the political world. I need to I need to make up a difference. So I got to get somebody with some spin, as far as the publicity is concerned. So I'll go with Derek Phillips to kind of even things out a little bit. All right, all right. I, I'm uh, I'm not gonna uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the honors of of picking our very own baseball coach. So you're, are you going to pick is, him now? Yeah, I'm going to pick him now. He's close to being Mr. Irrelevant. Because I know everywhere across America, people want to beat their bosses. And I'm quite sure Coach Holbrook is one of them. Make sure you, you have a rule <laughs> that he has to wear a hat. Okay. <laughs> Who else we have? We have two more. Audrey Smith, who's the head coach at uh, Clemson University, and uh, Justice Cunningham. Okay. Well, I tell you what, I, I, I'm going to pick Coach Smith because okay. I'm sure somewhere along the way on Saturday we'll have a chance to visit with the rivalry, so it'll be a lot of fun. We can share a lot of a lot of thoughts that we have about the Clemson-South Carolina rivalry. And last but not least, I got Justice. He's probably going to be the one. Um, he's going to probably replace uh, Sheriff Lott and be in our ace in the hole because he's the very last pick. I'll take him. And I'll use them and we'll win. <laughs>